Good day, peeps. All right, so it's another day, and we're gonna be off to Chris's because it's barbecue time. First, we gotta stop at the store, get some peanut butter and uh, ribs. So yeah, this is gonna happen. Where can I get good ribs though? That's the that's my only question. Apparently, not at Top Foods because they're all out. I honestly don't know. I don't know. <laughs> well, it doesn't happen very often, but when it does, people experience whiplash from turning their heads. I'm wearing my goggles. What kind of parking is this? Not need to be filmed. With a sensor blur, it does. That's not I'm, even, I'm gig That's not even really what's in there, though. For, so. Oh, nice. I just reused the jar. Well, looking at that fine ground powder substance, I would say it's opium. Opium? Yes. Raw opium. Take over the opium countries and slave the, the populace. That, that's Afghanistan. That's what a friend of mine said one time when we were playing Risk. That smells kind of familiar, actually. Hmm. Smells kind of like, uh... Smells kind of shallow. I don't know what that kind of smells like, actually. <laughs> smells like your face. <laughs> It's smell a vision. You get smell a vision. <laughs> In full high definition. Now the wind's probably blowing on the microphone. We need a name. So should I tell Joel to grab you some drinks and you'll pay him back? Or? Yes, I will pay him back. Not today, but soon. Hey, hey! This is what I require. I need one two liter of Dr. Pepper and one 64 ounce Snoopy. It's a drink of champions. Blue, a blue Slurpee. Fanta, blue, blue raspberry Fanta Slurpee. Those are good. Big one. Oof. You would think. Like they're completely unfazed by it. And then this one, which is not for resale. I meant from the uh, I have two copies. <laughs> that, <laughs> that one, I like the case better because it's smaller. And I made it a double case, team. so that way Christmas Nights is in it. Ah. Which is the oh, sample thing so you get for Christmas. And it's also worth like 50 bucks. Nice. This, so. <laughs> yeah. Of course, the Zelda Collector's Edition for GameCube was not for resale either, yeah. but... <laughs> yeah. Imagine, like, when this... Joystick first came out, like how people were dealing with that. Was I supposed to be using the joystick? 
because I was using the D-pad. That's probably why it's more difficult. It was set on the... Yeah, that's probably why. It wasn't working for this. It, <laughs> it's a 3D-pad, so it works for this and this. Okay. So, uh, I just had to switch the thing over. I didn't realize that. So I was doing... freaking. Professional at work. Yeah! It looks almost exactly like... Yeah, he finished that in like 20 seconds. Yeah. Uh, well. Uh. <laughs> oh, so he was playing on the D-pad the whole time? That's probably why yeah, it was more difficult than it should have been. <laughs> yeah, this is what I remember it actually kind of being like. A little more fluid. <laughs> I remember coming in the game crazy or whatever. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's <laughs> Still, I mean, he's like dominating. Hey, sir, can I buy this game? Yeah, just like. Jeez. Just flying through the rings. I'll find as good as many points as you can. So. Whew. Before your time is up. What? Tacoma game. Oh. Tacoma? Tacoma? Tacoma. Tacoma. How do you don't get the star on the top? Jesus. Ever? What star on the top? There's four stars around that little group of ships and you only get the... the seal no, oh, you missed it. <laughs> you mean Everybody. I got it? No, the star... I saw it. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, it goes to you, but how come you don't have to hit it? When you... Because you did a little loop and it sucks it up. Uh, oh, a bunch of coins on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Holy oh. crap. Here's, here's my main mob that I have. I have 199 marking games. It's not that many, really. Do you have... Some of them are multiple the same one. I, I downloaded a torrent that had like 6,000 of them, but... You know what's one of the hardest ones to find is the working version of the original Pac-Man. Because they have copyrighted the yeah, yeah. so everyone has a hard time actually. Like if it shows up on a website, it's like gone almost. Jeez. I've been put to shame. Well, <laughs> Oh, oh, thank God for that. Well, Joel's playing now? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Why do you think it's been looking so good? <laughs> I thought Josh switched to the... Yeah, I make one little adjustment and I'm as good as he is. <laughs> no, this is actually like a little demo video. <laughs> it's actually a computer doing it. It's <laughs> a <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, the colors. Jeez. <laughs> so you do a loop around things, you automatically get them? Yeah. Well, if you do it fast enough anyway. Yeah, not like the loops I was doing. You were doing loops? <laughs> <laughs> Dark, buddy, I can't see you. Can you see daddy? And I'm rusty, by the way. So. And you're rusty. <laughs> Talk. Johnny, that's you, it. You got like a long <laughs> nose. <laughs> Yellow. Are you recording it? <laughs> yep. <laughs> so, so, where's the long nose and yellow come from? SpongeBob. SpongeBob. That's where the whole story started. If you can like play his nose, the flute. Can you see? <laughs> So Abraham Lincoln now has a long nose. He already did have a long nose. Yellow. SpongeBob SquarePants Vampire Slayer. Words with friends. What would Patrick be in that movie? I was just trying to think about that. <laughs> Who was the vice president at the time? Uh, I don't know. Somebody fat. Oh, Matt. Um, <laughs> I think they became president after him. Matt wasn't around. I don't know my president. <laughs> now we talk about, I remember that one time, 1909. Uh, you mean 1902? 1902, whatever. Same thing. Uh, jiggle, 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 Matt. Oh, fat Matt. Matt. Creeble, jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. <laughs> fat. It really? So, outside my window, my neighbors have a trampoline set up. There's a bunch of kids that are jumping on it. So I turn the speakers in my room towards the window. <laughs> it's super playing that through. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Well, I'm just about ready to head into bed, but uh, it was a good day today, let me tell you what. Been me messing around with that new camera pretty much all day, and let me tell you what, it is just so awesome. It takes great pictures, the lenses that came with it are amazing, awesome, I love it. Uh, oh man, so, I mean, things have just been, I mean, you know. New camera, new game consoles, new games. I mean, things are going crazy. And on top of that, Friday, something else is going to happen. 
but you'll see it on Friday. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I can't believe it. But yeah. Been working on the website ideas and uh, video project ideas as well um, today. Did a lot of video editing. Um, the, the big one. And, uh, ooh, I cannot believe this. This was absolutely amazing. But um, an opportunity presented itself. And now, uh, Projected Twin, Sean Holton, um, back on May the 5th when we went up to Seattle and I met SMP Films, Caters, Projected Twin. I met all them up in Seattle. Um, well, Projected Twin is going to make me uh, a, a song for the Invincible, a custom song that I can use for my intro, which is just absolutely incredible. This is so amazing, and it's coming up right on my one year anniversary of my vlogging channel, which is even more exciting. So not only do I get my own theme song to the Invincible, it's made by the person I met four months ago in, in Seattle, almost five months ago now, and that's just abs I mean, he's in Australia. He lives in Australia, and that's just... It, it blows my mind seeing how an online community can bring people together from around the world. I cannot wait, and Sean, if you're watching this right now, I can't thank you enough. I'm looking so forward to hearing my new theme song for the Invincilog. So excited. So excited. But yeah, that happened. <laughs> but yeah, um, played some games online today as well. That was fun. League of Legends, I'm definitely into that one. Um, <sighs> Getting better, better at it. <sighs> Again, if you want to play League with me, Omega Apex 128, that's me. Um, but yeah, all in all, a good day though. Did some cleaning around the house, got some laundry done. Um, but that was about it. I mean, we didn't go out and about today or anything. Uh, just basically a good day to relax. Um, well, after working around the house anyway. You know, like I said, editing, cleaning, stuff like that. But uh, yeah, work tomorrow. Uh, should be a good day. Like I said, as of recently, the job schedule for me has actually been much busier workload. Um, so, I mean, hey, I'm all for that. Absolutely. I'm feeling very confident about each job that I go to. And, uh, my coworkers as well. I'm talking to them more, and and I, I seem to be connecting on different levels and uh, establishing more friendships. And I like it. I, it. This is really good for me. I think. Um, but yeah, I cannot believe we are already halfway through September. Uh, uh, I'm debating on whether or not I should get a Christmas tree. Like I I don't know. Um, at this point in time. There, Christmas is a toss-up. There's a little. There could potentially be a little bit of a plan, um, as far as a Christmas break is concerned, if you will. I mean, I've got some time off from work, um, and I just I'm trying to figure things out right now. So Christmas is kind of a toss-up right now, but it's you know we'll have something very soon. So um, hopefully by the end of the week. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and head to bed now because I'm, like I said, I'm tired and I go work tomorrow. So I will see you tomorrow for another great day of the vlogs and hopefully not one in my bedroom again. Good night. How long?